hello everyone thanks for watching our videos and uh, hope it is helpful for your studies so moving on to the next question the question is explain the different levels of nlp and this is also very important question because it is asked in the previous year question paper for couples of times so you have to read it uh, because um, maybe the chances of asking this question is uh, more so going in uh, detail so the levels of nlps are uh, lexical analysis syntactic analysis semantic analysis discourse analysis and pragmatic analysis these are the five different levels of nlps and uh, keep it in mind uh, represent the things or um, uh, what what you are uh, representing the answer represent the answer uh, by a structured format or uh, by a flow chart or by constructing the trees um, so so that it will add an extra value to your answer okay so these are all the five different levels of nlp so moving in detail <coughs> the first uh, uh, level of nlp is uh, lexical analysis so what is this lexical analysis lexical analysis is nothing but it's a simple level of analysis because it involves the analysis of word that is it's a word level analysis uh, it's a basic level it's a simple level of analysis okay uh, and what are these words words are nothing but it's a fundamental unit of natural language processing okay words are nothing but they are the fundamental unit of the natural language processing the word level processing require morphological knowledge okay to process this word level uh, uh, what's that um, to process these words or word level processing it is going to require the morphological knowledge what is this uh, morphological knowledge means uh, it is nothing but it's a knowledge about structure and uh, formation of the uh, words from the basic units uh, that is uh, morphemes okay <clears throat> the morphological knowledge means it's a knowledge about the structure and the words so what exactly this morphemes means uh, morphemes are the words that cannot be further divided okay that cannot be divided further so uh, let's uh, look into the example so that uh, you will be uh, easily understood understood uh, what is uh, the uh, what exactly the morphemes means okay uh, so i have uh, taken the example incoming so here in is nothing but it is a affix and ing this is the suffix and uh, come this is the root word okay so come this is the root word which cannot be further divided so removing this affix and suffix uh, take the root word so that is come uh, it cannot be divided further that is nothing but morphemes okay so um, just uh, i'll i would like to brief it out uh, the thing what i have discussed in the lexical analysis so lexical analysis first point is it is nothing but it's a simple representation and also it involves the word level uh, processing or word level analysis because it's a simple representation right and also uh, the word level processing require the morphological knowledge what is what exactly this morphological knowledge means it's a knowledge about the structure and the words okay uh, words means it's a basic unit right a uh, basic unit right uh, it is nothing but uh, it's a morphemes so what what exactly this morphemes morphemes are nothing but they are the words which cannot be further divided so uh, take an example that is incoming or you can take uh, any other examples like speaking so ing is the prefix uh, it is not mandatory that you you must have affix and prefix both are both should be included uh, this is not mandatory so uh, just take an example speaking so you will be having ing speak plus ing so speak is the root word remove the ing word that is the uh, which is that uh, suffix you remove that ing so here now the speak is the root word uh, so speak is nothing but morphemes which cannot be which cannot be further divided so you can take uh, many example okay so this is about the lexical analysis and uh, i'll be discussing the next analysis that is syntactic analysis in the next video thank you so much for watching the video